heard another sad song again. I thought these were our day. I guess I should pretend everything is okay. I'll close my eyes and take a breath. Let in the emptiness. I guess I let them guess that everything is okay. A beautiful bloom, symmetrical. Natural, probably organic, nothing can go wrong, but in a few days, it will die. Some of the petals are less symmetrical than others. There's a beetle underneath these leaves. Lady Macbeth says, look like the innocent flower, but be the serpent under it. Every innocent flower is a serpent, but every serpent could also be an innocent flower. I don't know why you think Jane is more your responsibility than mine. You haven't been as loyal as you'd like to think. I'm always there for her. At the bottom of everything, I'm always there. Without me, she's not going to be motivated to do anything. I'm going to eat away at her until she takes action. Until she talks to him, because she has to. Or until she gets tired of double checking her messages and goes to bed. Better than never writing the message in the first place. I don't know why she needs someone to love her anyway. I mean, no one really loves her except us. At least we agree on that. I think you'd find, my dear, if you listen to me, we agree on a lot more. For example, why do you let her sleep so long when she could be lying awake analyzing the events of the day? And then when she falls into sweet oblivion, the exhaustion will make it all the sweeter. We'll see how this plays out. No one should be alone. Who else would you share your teeming thoughts with? I'm not sure what teeming thoughts would be. I'm not going to be able to make it today. I have a meeting tonight. But I still want to. Can we maybe do it tomorrow? Or the day after? If you're sure. Not that important. You don't have to. No. I want to. How about I meet you Thursday at 7? If you're sure. Love you. I know, it's okay. No, 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 this isn't the whole story. We gotta backpedal here. Suit yourself. I don't understand. Why did you quit that job? It wasn't worth the stress it was causing. All jobs are stressful, Jane. Another one isn't going to be any different. Don't you think mine is stressful? <sighs> Look. It's okay to admit that you don't like your work, but you have to be an adult and do it. Find another one. Are you sure you'll be able to? No. And won't this look bad on your resume, quitting this one? I, didn't you quit your last one? Hello? Is this really interesting? I and mean, they were really afraid it was gonna be bad. They were actually pretty paranoid. They had one cut that was a comedy and one cut that was a drama, and so they ended up splicing them together because they couldn't choose. So it's just really uneven, you know? Hmm. Are you okay? I spoke to my sister. I shouldn't have told her I was quitting my job again. Her evaluation of you doesn't matter. Only yours does. And if you really feel bad about quitting your job... I'll be able to find another. I'm smart. But it could happen again. I don't want it to happen again. If that's honestly how you feel, then maybe you should go talk to someone. Someone other than me. Maybe. I just need to get out of my head. Tell me something you like. Something you did recently that you really liked. I had a good sandwich the other day. I just want to warn you that this next week I'm going to be pretty busy. I want to
to listen, but I'm gonna be working pretty late. So maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to open up to some other people. You sure you're not just tired of me? Just busy. Jesus, Jane. I was joking. All I was was joking. Well, that was a bust. You shouldn't encourage her to say so much, get so defensive. It's just words. That's remarkably optimistic for you. So you think she'll be fine if we just do nothing? If you think that's optimistic, you haven't been listening. See, the way I see it, we're opposites. Too much and too little. Oh, so I'm fat now. I see how it is. I'm too much. Not you. We don't have to just disappear. Well, that's not going to happen anyway. We got to learn to move together, work together, dance together. How many people have you tried that line on? I'm not sure. Probably others. I'm not sure. Oh, but she's got to solve this problem. She's got to prepare for the worst. How would you feel if she didn't prepare for the worst? You mean like Ellison leaving her? Ellison being disgusted and bored? Shh. How could you say that out loud? Don't say that. She might be listening. No one is listening. Well, as you say, I've already analyzed the possibility of that. I've calculated dozens of possible dialogue strands that could lead to that, and a dozen more to prevent it. Okay, what do I have to say to help you calm down? See, now you have a goal. Isn't that just better than just sitting around doing nothing? I don't sit around doing nothing because I want to. I am still because there's nothing else to do. I'm not waiting for anything. I'm just scraped out. You look fine for being scraped out. Some help you are. Just kids, we didn't know We had our lives, goes to show Our whole lives ahead of us Ahead of us Caroline, my soul is shining bright Caroline, it's all because of you Exhausting, aren't you? What? Oh, I didn't hear you. We really have to do something about Jane, you know. Looking back, we've come a long way. all the spying. There's no excuse. What would you have her do when she gets bored? Why does she have to do anything? Oh, I understand. If you need to cancel. You said you'd be busy this week anyway. Is this one of those times that you'd like to be angry at me, but you're worried I'm going to be mad if you are? I'll try not to be like that. But then we both get to be mad. See? Never mind. The more work I get done, the sooner I'll be free, right? It means a lot when you text, you know? To let me know you're thinking about me. At work, I'm supposed to be thinking of work. And it might be good... It might be good for you to spend some time with other people, you know? Clear your head. Make some more friends. All right. That sounded desperate. Not really. Hey, you said you were worried about her before. 
I'm just trying to lighten the mood. She wouldn't like me talking about her. But are you worried? I just wish she would get out of her head. I never... I don't know which side of her I'm going to get. Hmm. But, but she's really great, though. Good. I really... I really love her. Well, looks like things have hit. She's really gonna need us now. Why are you watching so closely? Celeste, Celeste, don't you care? One wrong word and the whole thing could fall apart. It must be so nice being so constantly in motion all the time. Think of the calories you burn, think of your energy. I've often been told I need to relax. Just don't worry yourself about this. Take it from me, I've seen this before. What do you mean? Long before I met you, long before she met you, it was just her and me, best buds. Looks like you've made a lot of progress. Look at her now! What a success! I'll choose to ignore that coming from somebody who can't even decide on a shirt. Just let me take care of things, okay? I'll just manage them. You'll see. It's nice, you know, to finally relax. delightful. I have to do that more often. So you enjoyed yourself? <laughs> more or less. There were so many grains of sand to count, and I could count them all. I could move as quickly as you wanted. And when I swam, even the sharks couldn't catch me. But wait, the sharks. How's the plan going? Did you solve that problem with Jane? See for yourself, I've solved a couple things. That's it? What's she been doing? What's she been thinking about? How many scenarios has she mapped out? Nothing. That's the beauty of it. This, this is ridiculous. Hey, that's my handiwork you're talking about. But you know what? Never mind. I'm zen now, man. I'm winning. What are you going to do? You're not happy. You haven't solved anything. You think time's going to stand still for her? How long are you going to keep this up before she... This isn't a sustainable- What do you care if I'm happy or not? I, at least I have control of the situation. Don't you think a little action could be good? Whatever, apparently what I'm doing isn't good enough. I don't really care. Fine, let me take over. I promise you won't regret it. I wave my hands and... your voice I couldn't see your face I couldn't judge your noise 
make such a big difference. She's expecting something from him. Scenarios. I don't know what you meant to achieve by that. I just want something to happen. She's just as lost as she is with me. Just calm down. It doesn't matter. <sighs> it does matter. It matters too much. But why does it matter too much? Because I'm the only one who cares. If I don't worry about it, no one will. It'll just fall, dissipate into air. But why you? Because if I care about everything, I won't get in trouble. The only one you'll get in trouble with is yourself. That just makes things worse. I know. I don't believe you don't care about anything. You don't want everything to be still. You're moving with me, talking to me. You know how much I just want someone to talk to me? I don't mind so much talking with you. Just stand still a second, okay? Just take a step back. Truce? A truce means no more conflict. It doesn't necessarily mean working together. Could we work together now, though? Please? I think I can. Everything looks fine here. Um, just one more question. Uh, how do you feel you respond to stress? Stress isn't a fun time for anyone. But the other side is always there. I'll be in touch. Things seem to be back to normal. What do you think? No normal is permanent. Oh, believe me, I know. I'm not trying to get rid of my thoughts right now, but sometimes they can entertain themselves. Be a satellite I don't really know how this is going to work. This is 
pretty new for me. Somewhere between motion and the lack of it. That's where we'll be. Waiting here for you. 